Soul Calibur 6. Yo, we're on Soul Calibur 6. It's been a while I've actually played this game and I did want to try it out. Let's do the story mode, man. Begin episode. Solid, this story reaches far back into the darkest death of history. In the 16th century, the legend tried to rear its ugly head again. Transcending history and the world, a tale of souls and swords eternally retold. Soul Edge, a legendary sword and devourer of souls. Buried in the darkest reaches of history, it was brought back to light in the 16th century. The notorious pirate Cervantes claimed the sword as his own, setting everything into motion. Beast. Soul Edge adapted itself to its new owner by splitting into two. Oh shit. Possessed by the evil weapons, Cervantes began a bloody reign of terror, slaying all those seeking the swords without prejudice. Cervantes he ended up using was eventually that to kill. Undone. Under the protection of Hephaestus, the god of smithing, a female warrior named Sophitia was Sophitia. able to destroy one of the swords. Shards of the blade flew and lodged into her body, causing near mortal wounds. Seeing his chance, Cervantes raised his sword to deliver the final blow. Suddenly, there appeared a ninja known as Taki, who rescued oh, Taki. the wounded warrior. Taki defeated Cervantes in a battle to the death before carrying the injured Sophitia away. Dang, that's crazy. However, one of Soul Edge's two blades still remained. Perhaps it was fate. The blade fell into the hands of Siegfried, whose mind was twisted and unwell. I think he becomes sent to, uh, he becomes Nightmare. He's taking over. Look at that, he looks like a badass. Yep, he turns into a nightmare. A pillar of light pierced the heavens, the product of rampant evil, the evil seed. No one could have predicted it would become a catalyst for catastrophe across the world. Our story takes place in the 16th century. So this is the first one. Go. A tragedy befell this place. Ling Shan Su Temple was a famous martial arts school in the far reaches of China. It was there Killick learned to master the staff after he was abandoned as Damn, a child. Killick is one of the OGs. Killick ate and slept with the other students and began his training at a young age. Despite this, he established a family-like bond with just one other student, Shang Len, a young girl who was like an elder sister to him. Shang Len. Dedicated to the way of the sword, she looked after Killick as if they were siblings. So close was their bond that She's when a one felt happy too. or sad, the other would feel the same. Together they studied and grew as warriors.
the years passed by. Killick's skill earned him a place as a teacher, an honorable position for one so young. Throughout the ages, Ling Sheng Su Temple had kept hold of the three sacred treasures, Krita Yuga, Devapara Yuga, and Kali Yuga. Killick's years of arduous training earned him the title of rightful bearer of the staff, Kali Yuga. Likewise, Shang Len was also designated bearer of Devapara Yuga, a sacred mirror. Our story begins on the night before the ritual for passing the treasures on to their new masters. Shang Lin, can I ask you something? Oh, it has sure. his own audio. That's cool. How come you were chosen to bear Devapara Yuga? I don't have to read this shit. I thought you'd get Krita Yuga. After all, you've dedicated your life to the sword. <sighs> Kalek, this is not easy for me to talk about, but I'm going to try. What's going on? The Krita Yuga. It's no longer at Ling Shang Su. The sword has been gone for more than a decade. All that's left is the Kali Yuga and the Devapara Yuga. Really? So it was stolen or some shit? Surprised? Well, there's more. The one who stole the Krita Yuga was none other than well, so they my the... father. Her father. That's why I don't have the right to bear it. If I were to accept the sword, everyone would be up in arms. That's why, even though it was offered to me, I decided to decline. That's crazy. Of course, I love Ling Shang Su, and I do wish to see my studies through to their conclusion. It's just, I. Yeah, man, that's tough. I just don't want the sacred treasures, or my status as a sacred bearer, or anything else to hold me back. You know what the monks say. Fate, Fate is carved, carved with, with your, your own hands. hands. When okay. I spoke to them about that, they decided to let me bear Devapara Yuga instead. Now I can feel proud that I'm a sacred bearer just like you. Um, you know something, Killick? What? Uh, it's okay. Never mind. Yo, that's really what's up. Now I want to know. Tomorrow. Me too. What happened? And so it was, Killick and Shang Len were set to attend the official ritual for becoming sacred bearers. Hey man, when is but the, the fight going to start? before the ritual, a terrible calamity plunged everything into chaos. Drawn by the Kali Yuga in Killick's hand, the evil seed came to Ling Shen Su Temple. The monks, driven insane by the evil force, began slaying each other, turning the temple into hell on earth. Oh, shit. What have I done? So you did it. Oh, what the fuck? Yo, what's going on? I don't understand. Everyone, stop this madness! Yeah! Yo, I'm trying to fight already. Fight. Oh, shit, I am gonna fight. Oh shit. Trying to do all these fucking tricks and shit. Yeah. Is it just one? Oh, yeah, it's just one match. I've been waiting to fight. Alright, what's next? It's kill 
or be killed. Huh? What's going on? Oh, don't tell me. Shang Lin? Is she possessed or something? Get a hold of yourself, Shang Lin. See your red eyes? Yeah. So I'm gonna fight her. No? I wanted to fight him. I could, I could skip Where it, but I, I want to know what's going on. <clears throat> Mysterious old Did man. Did you save me? Who are you? <sighs> you have yet to recover from your injuries. Rest. And that mirror. Devapara Yuga. Wear it always. There will be grave consequences if you do not. Understand. Uh. Oh. oh, Sean Lin. Damn. <laughs> Something went on, man. Something went up. What so. happened? The power of Tavapara Yuga saved me. That means Shaolin. She gave it to me. She sacrificed her life for me. So Shaolin already passed away? And then I, I with my bare hands. Why? Tell me, Shaolin. Why am I still alive? Have you not realized yet? You are being protected. Devapara Yuga suppresses the evil within you. Evil? The old man proceeded to tell a tale. He told Killick about the evil seed. How Devapara Yuga had pulled Killick back from the brink of insanity. So everybody how Kali Yuga had the ability to absorb power, and how it was falling under an evil spell. And finally, he told Killick about, about Soul, Soul Edge. Age. Your fate will be set in stone the moment you lose your will to live. Your soul will be swallowed whole by your destiny. Leaving behind but a rotten corpse. That is but one path you may take. But perhaps it is the path you wish to take. To submit to that evil sword and its wicked power. Is hey man, I'm trying to fight you, you know? To become a thrall? Do you see? All is in your hands. Shang Lin. She, she told, told me fate, fate is carved, carved with your own hands. hands. Shang Lin gave her life so I could live. That leaves me only one choice. From that day forth, Killik we'll bore the man. heavy weight we'll of his karma. As Shang Lin's slayer and the last living member of Ling Shang Su, he chose to face his cruel fate head on. I'm just trying to fight, man. But I don't know, man. I feel like these videos are gonna be a bit longer. They talk too much. <laughs> if you continue upon this path, the evil within you will create a second soul edge out of Kali Yuga. The only reason you and Kali Yuga have yet to succumb 
is because of Devapara Yuga's power. However, all is not lost. You can learn to control the evil within. Yes, Master. I am trying to understand what is the hell is going it? on. Man. If this tests you so dearly, how do you intend to stand up to evil? <sighs> Sorry, Master. To control evil, you must first control yourself. Mastering your own will is the key to so overcoming So even malice. more trained. Yes, master. After all that, the enemy he's is a powerful. teacher, but he still you has must to be stand teacher. strong, whoever your opponent. Uh, yes, master. <sighs> Kilik, your next opponent awaits. Who? Who's that? Sometimes things reveal themselves when you fight. I understand. Ooh, all right, Master. let's go. Let's go into the match. Maybe we'll find out who it is. Battle one. Fight. It doesn't say the name. I'm ready. Too simple. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? I'm ready. Not quite. Yeah. Yeah, straight. Oh, wait. Oh, there's more. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I got him. Oh, shit. You got me, you got me. Oh, no, I missed. Too easy. Straight. That was sick. That was sick. Trying to move fast here, Russell. Oh, perfect! I didn't even see it. I thought he hit me at least once. But we Gucci, man. Perfect. It's all W's here. So, did you learn something? Yes. I believe I felt how delicate the balance is between myself and evil. I see. I didn't even then see the anything. Time has almost come. Master? I didn't understand. It is nothing. What are you doing? You have yet to finish your training for the day. Yes, Master. Let's continue this shit real quick. Kilik, you have borne the burden of your training well. Yes, Master. Now we shall see how you fare against me. Oh, I'm about to. Right, let's see, let's see how this shit goes, with man. You? It would be an honor. Why do me you against back? my master. Come at me. Yes, Master. Yeah! Wait, I thought I was gonna fight. Am I gonna fight? Oh man, you I thought I was gonna proved. fight. I understand why you were chosen to bear Kali Yuga. <sighs> He's wherever he... Why? A shadow lies upon your soul. Take heed. If it envelops you completely, the evil within you will stir, and in time, tear at your soul until there is nothing left. You need to banish that shadow. 
I have shown you how to control evil. The rest is up to you. Yes, Master. The rest is up to me. Kilik, this will be your final test. You must seal away Soul Edge, the cause of all this madness, and cleanse yourself of evil. Yes, Master. Okay, so I have to be... So there's gonna be a lot of... Sh oh, shit. Keep so I'm going gonna to where the fight them. Of Soul Edge awaits in the heart of a great maelstrom. This is gonna be crazy. You must live on, as have I. <laughs>